Dylan. He always had an inkling for the sea. That moondrift child with the seaweed curls, his laughter melted sea foam. Scooping up into shovels the dwindling dregs, patted into proud battlements, watched as the water slowly inundated, crumbling moats and crooked towers to sink beneath the ever growing storm. His first kisses were at this quayside, soft, like wet sand he took her mermaid hand in his. She shrank back eyes wide as the seals afraid of the coming tide. They lobbed pebbles ferociously at waiting rocks, placed seashells to ears, listened to hear the flowing voices of sirens in the tides ebb and fall. And in his later years, landlocked would peer into the lulling froth of beer and imagine mermaids pulling him back in again to the dark and creamy depths. Caught out by Rossilli tides, they awaken from the belly of the worm to a wonderland of giant bluebells reflected across the gaping horn of the bay to distant shores and bobbing pygmy boats and feel themselves explorers in a strange, exotic land. Somewhere in a dim hotel, he's a rocking boat all adrift. She flashes him a fish hook smile, reels him in, gills flapping, but at his embrace dissolves into bubbles, her laughter reverberating across the waters.